There's a saying that life is a journey, and rightfully so. From the greatest individuals to the weakest, everyone goes through ups and downs. Every situation is a choice, and each step in life is like a small test. Every decision leads you in a certain direction. That's why it's crucial to learn to observe human life, to watch others and the decisions they've made that brought them to this point in their lives. Learn from both the great men and the less experienced. There's a story about a sage. One day, the sage was sitting under a tree, and some people approached and sat down beside him. They asked the sage a simple question, how did you become so wise? The sage turned to them, looked at them for a moment and replied, because I learn from fools, I observe their decision-making process and avoid doing the things that got them into trouble. The same holds true for your life. Let every moment of your life be filled with observations. It's the easiest way to shorten 10, 20 or even 30 years off your learning curve and position yourself ahead of the 99%. Remember that life is brimming with lessons. It's your duty as a human to remain a student throughout life. The moment you believe you're a master and have learned enough is the moment you'll stop growing. So, what are some of the lessons and principles that men should keep in mind? Lesson 1. Happiness is a personal choice. Happiness is a decision that only you can make for yourself. Much of your joy comes from within and you must have control over your emotions. Just as the pursuit of physical pleasure should not consume your thoughts, true happiness is not solely dependent on satisfying primal desires, including sexual ones. Don't rely on others to create your happiness, as this is a common pitfall in relationships. When you enter a relationship expecting your partner to be your sole source of happiness, it often leads to disappointment. Your happiness is your responsibility, this applies not only to relationships, but to every facet of life. For example, on a rainy day, one person might find joy in the rain while another curses the weather. It's all about your mindset. Remember, happiness is a daily choice you must make. One way to cultivate this mindset is by disconnecting from social media. Social media often does more harm than good, despite its promise of bringing people closer together. In reality, it frequently achieves the opposite effect, fostering envy and discontent among users. Lesson 2. Everything is temporary. The good times and the bad, they're all fleeting. When life's great, embrace it fully and be thankful. When challenges arise, stay composed and tackle them head on. Remember, even the finest days will end someday. So if emotions threaten to overwhelm you, stay resolute and keep a clear head. Lesson 3. Life isn't fair. Let's face it, life hands us different decks of cards. Some start with advantages, others with none. You can complain and resent your circumstances, but the responsibility for crafting your best life ultimately falls on you. The life you dream of often lies on the other side of the challenges you're avoiding. It's like that old saying, if you seek happiness, start with discomfort. Don't wait around, take action, stop grumbling and start doing. These are the cornerstones of being a resilient and resourceful individual. Lesson 4. Taking risks in life. The biggest risk can often be not taking risks at all. Look around and you'll find that many successful folks took action to reach where they are. Anything worthwhile typically involves some level of risk. Take, for instance, being interested in someone you find attractive. If you want to win them over, you've got to step up and start a conversation. Now, that might seem intimidating, especially for many guys who freeze up when that opportunity arises. But whether it's in the realm of dating or leaving your regular job for a more promising career, most things worth having come with an element of risk. The choice, my friends, is yours. Embrace the risk and truly live. Lesson 5. The Power of Being Present it's a common tendency for many of us to dwell either in the past or the future. However, residing in these realms can be quite detrimental. While it's perfectly fine to plan for the future, it shouldn't overshadow your present. Thinking about the future is essential for direction, but don't get stuck there. Let your future thoughts gently guide you as you work diligently in the present to achieve your desired lifestyle. The same goes for living in the past, 
Reminiscing about the good old days won't bring them back. It's living in the now that truly matters. Remember, having a purpose is the key to living each day to the fullest. Without it, you risk becoming a mindless wanderer stuck between past and future. Lesson 6. The Trap of Overthinking As we grow, we tend to overanalyze everything. Minor actions by others can send us into a spiral of thoughts and emotions. Maybe someone didn't bid you farewell at work, and suddenly you're convinced they despise you. These thoughts can eat away at you, even if the other person had no ill intent. Stop feeding these thoughts, and most importantly, don't conjure up imaginary scenarios in your head. The remedy to overthinking is action. So when you feel yourself sinking into that abyss of thoughts, break free through action. Lesson 7. Follow your passion and choose your career wisely. Your work is a significant part of your life. Imagine someone who loves programming. They wouldn't suddenly switch to civil engineering even if coerced. Such a shift would likely lead to inefficiency. Your time is precious, so dedicate it to developing skills that will advance your career. Many people squander half their lives pursuing careers or skills dictated by others, like their parents or friends, rather than pursuing their own interests. If you're unhappy with your chosen field, you won't find satisfaction in your career, and this discontent will spill into other areas of your life. This is what we mean by investing in yourself. It should apply to your personal life too. Engage only in activities that align with your purpose and mission. Lesson 8. Your mind is your greatest ally and adversary. The most crucial life lesson revolves around your mindset. You are the architect of your life's outcomes. You can't blame others for your failures or shortcomings. In almost every case, your thoughts determine whether you succeed or fail. Train your mind to be your greatest supporter. It's with you for life. Your reflection should elicit self-endorsement, as if your mind sees you as a role model. This is a shared trait among all successful individuals. Remember, life is a precious gift to be cherished daily. Keep learning as a lifelong student and apply these invaluable life lessons early. You're unlikely to regret it. By recognizing the power of your thoughts, you can harness your mind's potential to steer your life in the direction you desire. Embrace challenges as opportunities to mold your mindset into a force that propels you forward. Be vigilant against negative self-talk and doubt, for they can hinder your progress. Nurture a positive and growth-oriented inner dialogue, one that acts as a constant guide towards your aspirations. Remember, your mind can be both a loyal companion and a formidable opponent, but ultimately it's your perspective that determines which role it plays. Continually cultivate self-awareness, for understanding the intricate workings of your mind is a journey that never truly ends. Just as a gardener tends to their plants, tend to your thoughts with care. Weed out negativity and doubt, replacing them with the seeds of belief and resilience. Your mind's landscape is malleable, shaped by the thoughts you choose to water and nurture. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and stay tuned for more content. Until next time.